So this video is intended as a sort of follow-up to yesterday's video where I played this weird veil of darkness pile with dark creators and all this nonsense. Uh, I decided to take out the veil of darkness and like make a serious attempt at trying to slim it down and, and make it potentially better. Um, we're on still on all the value stuff with the dark creators, the dark greffers, uh, on a bunch of the dark packages with like Dad and... Um, Necrogarden O'Malley, you know, the uh, the Salvo, the, the Plague. Uh, the reason we're not on Well stuff and we're on the Salvo stuff instead is, is because I feel like the Salvo stuff inherently has more synergy with the Dark Creator because you can go, like, Black Rose the Field and then just drop the Dark Creator, and that's that's really good. Um, so, yeah, it, it has some potential to do some cool stuff. It looks like a just insane sack fest pile, which... Uh, could definitely be fun, so let's see how we did in our replays. Alright, so we got two pretty short uh, replays here to go over. Uh, first one up against um, a bit of a meme deck. My opponent's playing this normal monster thing. It's it's super cool. Super cool. It plays Knight of the Red Lotus and like makes a bunch of synchro plays and stuff. Definitely very neat. <laughs> we're, we're just drawing nothing in this game, number one. So... There's definitely definitely showing off the brick potential of this deck for sure. Uh, so we're gonna get beat over, taking a bunch of damage, and then we finally draw the Dark Greffer. Thank God. Um, we Sark for Dad. We go, and then I realize like we can't out this stupid Rush recklessly for normal monsters card. But then he kind of just outs it for me because he thinks he can go for a game with Storm. But we have like double Gardena to stop that, so he ends up black rosing the field. Uh, then we special out the Dark Creator, get the Greffer, send the Plague, attack, attack. We get Mirrored, which kind of sucks, but we are just going to summon Dad next turn, so it's like, whatever. I have the Gardener to stay alive. So we can stack for Plague, use two sets of Vayus to get a bunch of Darks out of my grave, and then we have three, and then we drop Dad, and he concedes because he knows Dad is coming. So that's the end of game number one. Game number two, he opens his Enchanted Fitting Room, hits two guys. And then he's just going to set pass. Okay. So we Sark for Dad again. Here he makes a sick play. He Brio's my back row and then makes Urbellum. And uh, puts back one of my monsters. So that kind of sucks. Here he maybe should have specialed that Knight of the Red Lotus and attack. Because I think I would have had to mirror to stay alive. Yeah, I definitely would have. So we get the dad. I decide that outing this stuff, since I still have this mirror force, I just want to get rid of this stupid Stardust Dragon. And then now I feel pretty good. So he hits. I have the mirror. All is well. We attack. Uh, we summon the Greffer. Probably should have just sent a Gardener here in case of some random top deck somehow killing us. Like, I don't know. Something. Um, but he goes for Black Rose. He opts not to pop the field, just hits. And we have Plague at a Dark End into Lethal. So we're going to clean up that match against the extremely based normal monster uh, deck. And then other matches up against... This guy was playing like Zombie Sworn something. It was pretty cool too, actually. Uh, game number one, we opened both our salvos, so I decide I pretty much have to send to Koichi, or two of the cards in my hand are dead. Um, we Sark for Dark Creator. I could have maybe just waved here because I was going for lethal um, to like prevent any kind of clapback. But yeah, he's super dead to uh, to the random hard drawn dark arm dragon. Feels bad, uh, but I'm gonna get some payback in this game, I believe. He goes set Raiko. Okay, I go Rota for Armonite. My hand's actually pretty good this game, which is it's weird, but I don't know. I go I go like super in when maybe I shouldn't have. Yeah, I'm not sure about that play I did. But he top decks dad, and then it's just live, and he, he, he like... Okay, now we're kind of screwed. I figure I can stack for Plague and Vanish Mally and try to hit over this Lila. And then make Dark End main too, but he has Mirror, so... um, Yeah, we're going to the... We're going to the game number three here. Uh, we open Dust Shoot, and the opponent has a subpar hand, so that's just auto win. Unfortunate for them. I rip the Mally so they can't allure. And because I want him to hit in my Gores. And then... Then I top deck Minecon, which was just a dirty, dirty play by me. Um, so we summon everything, attack, 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 attack. 
and we make armor master with his own monster and we set solemn judgment so like i think the game is pretty much over and yeah that is that is the end so uh this build's probably better than the other version but honestly it's still just like a bricky sack pile so i wouldn't uh, i wouldn't be too high on it that being said there's some fun stuff uh, i love the dark creator as a card i think it's pretty cool and you can sack people with dad a bunch so i mean it's uh it's not the worst all right hope you guys enjoyed this uh short little video be sure to like comment subscribe you know the drill i'll see you next time